Oh! Hey, hello everybody, welcome back to Just Fred. Last episode we... Uh, we went around some islands to get a, uh, to get the stuff that we could get with the shovel and the down jab, which we got. And uh, after that, we decided to go over to the water world and we ended up in the casino. And we got rich. We got freaking rich. We hit the jackpot and got 30,000 coins. Which is still unbelievable and amazing. Uh, this episode, we're just going to continue going through the water world. Later on in the game, I will return here to get the ultimate gear. Because you can buy ultimate gear with the amount of money that you get over here. But first, we have to watch all of these cutscenes of us being swept away. Oh, love the music though. Love everything. Except some aspects of the game, maybe. Well, actually, mm, I'm just gonna shut up. How about that? Because well, from the moment that I said I like something, I get uh, I get a brick thrown in my face. Yeah, good. We also got the fireball attack, which is pretty cool. But aside from being cool, that's basically it. probably not gonna use it that much since I'm used to using the sword. Ow! So with seagulls with bombs, if if the seagulls aren't in, uh, aren't annoying enough. And that's it for this little part, I think. Yep. This place is very confusing. That's all I remember about this place, just being confusing as hell. Getting lost, going the wrong way. And wasting a butt ton of time in general. Hey. A vine. And then some clams. I'm not sure if you can... I think you can kill these clams. <laughs> some, uh... It's... Sorry, what's the name again? Um, some starfish, there we go. And this brings me over here. It leads me over to... Place with water in it, and I need it to be drained, of course. What else did I expect? But hey, what did you expect? Not much, actually. Die. Money! Yes, I need more money for the casino! <clears throat> uh, let's go and use heal. We also got uh, another magic bottle which gave us time stop, but it's not really that handy. Or at least not for us. Or at least not. No, I, don't, I don't think it's very handy in general. <laughs> um, shovel. Nah, that might have been a mistake. We will figure. <laughs> we will find out in just a sec if it was a mistake. It was not. Whoop. <clears throat> Whoop. There we go. Do -do 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 -do. And then we go over here and we equip our ice sword again. Then knock this guy in the shell. Heal again because I got hit in the face. Later on in the game we can of course use this thing multiple times which is quite handy. I'm not sure what the maximum amount of health is that you can get. <sighs> You're a real character to reach this point to beat the boss. Hit his feet while his head is up. Well then, that was kind of pointless. Well, I know the boss of this area, well, I know. <laughs> Quote unquote, know the boss of this area, so it's, it's actually not, not that important. But at least you guys know it now. I've noticed one annoying aspect about my setup. My well, it's the side thingies for my chair because my my thing is that my arms are starting to ache after a while. Because it's freaking plastic. So, yeah, don't expect no DX razor shenanigans. No, it's just it's just a normal ass chair. A not a super comfortable normal ass chair. I... Alright, I'm, I'm gonna say something that might offend some people. Not, not offend, but no. I don't really understand why you'd spend that much money on a chair. But it depends on what you do. If you are... Like, a whole in... A uh, whole day... Whole day. <laughs> like, if you're day in, day out, sitting on this... On that chair, doing a lot of shenanigans. <laughs> um, then I can understand you by just to... Make your work easier. 
<laughs> but aside from that, I think it's pointless. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Is it you, milkman? Not the milkman! Uh, dang, I don't need to. I did not want to go over here. Yes, you can use these things, uh, these, these things, this attack, and I can bounce off of enemies' heads, which is quite special. They don't get uh, another another trust type attack thingy magic, and it will help you. Man, when you have the one going down, you have the one. Uh, blah, blah, blah. You eventually have one up here yeah, that makes you attack upwards. You might have already noticed it, but I took a little break, so um, once again, I'm gonna have to roll into the commentary again. Okay, shining that those things were still activated. Okay, switch back to not this. <laughs> uh, so I switch back to fireballs and 500 freaking coins. <laughs> pocket change <laughs> compared to what I got, basically. Basically, pocket change. Mm, let's go into this. And then I have enough space to switch back to my ice sword. My ice sword. I still like. In fact, I'm supposed to say ice sword, but I can't say ice sword. A man with wings may instantly transform back to the entrance or to the hot springs. To the hot springs. Hmm. Ping, ping. Interesting. Move. <laughs> Alright, uh, I guess I'm gonna go back to the one area with the... Uh, the one area with the thing and the other thing and the... There we go. Well, for the moment that you get the, um, the shovel, the game starts... Well... In this whole area, they use it a lot of times because you it's basically one of the, like, the main upgrades for this area. But it's really annoying to use this. You always have to equip it and then de-equip it again. It's just annoying, basically. That's what I'm trying to say. Ah, there we go. <laughs> ah, lovely! But I think the downward thrust that I got is mm, not totally optional. I think you need it eventually, but... I got it pretty early right now. So, we finally get Wing. Cannot be used here. Wing is uh, a type of magic that you can use. Star Oh, boy. Uh, the, <laughs> the Wing uh, magic is a magic that you can use to basically fast travel. I think I need to go to the magic area for that one. Ah, the magic area. Jesus. The freaking ice area. <clears throat> well, I'll come back here later on anyway, so... Oh, this room. This room sucks. This is the room I was talking about in the beginning of the game. I think with the trampolines. Or maybe it could have been later on in the game also. I don't know. There's some upward uh, thrust blocks that we cannot break at the moment. Oh, that urchin is so annoyingly placed. You know what? This asks for... I I told you that it wasn't that handy, but... Let's go and use it. Or, nah, it's actually really not a good idea to use it now. Dang it. The problem is these enemies just respawn, so killing them wouldn't really make that much of a difference. <laughs> killing you wouldn't make any difference anyway. Uh, you know, sure, let's go into this. Now you are stuck in place, and I can do this. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, not the shield. The, uh... Magico. Magic. Recovery. There we go. Alright. Can I get that chest? No, whoops. So, it would have been a nice idea to return and... Ah, uh, to return and uh, equip the... Ah, equip and... Flick on the switch in the other thing. In the ice area. Works well against water. Okay. Hmm. Has to be something down here. Okay. <laughs> Works well against water. Doesn't make any sense. Just armor. 
The equipment in this whole area doesn't make any sense. It's good against water! Okay! <laughs> Put a wetsuit on. Come on, come on. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker! There we go. Alright, now we can continue onwards. Yeah. Uh, this way? <laughs> no! Oh, wait, this is actually. Oh, wait! Oh, wait! This actually brings you back to the area that I was at before. Yes. Now everything makes sense. Ooh. Magic! Seagull. I can actually play on the um, on the recording screen, basically, which is freaking amazing. Means that I, I in uh, in normal English, it means that uh, I have no delay on my capture card, which is amazing, and <laughs> just feels satisfying. Aside from that, there's not much to it. I really hope that I'm not gonna need any. Um... Okay, thank you. Please, don't let me run into a dead end, because then I'm going to cry. Well, that that one part with the platforms was a little bit too difficult and annoying to do then. Well, not difficult, but too annoying to do to really want to do it again. Um, shovel. Shovel! Dig it! Dig a dig, dig a dig. Okay. And we get us. I cannot even press the switches. When... Ah, fuck it, I'm gonna go fisting. Yes, you just heard me say that. This lowers the water, probably. I can't really think of any other way that it would... Like, anything else that it would do. Okay, let's go and switch back to the ice sword. Works well against fire. Yes, because this place is on fire! Come on. Stop screwing with me! Okay, so, um, is there a switch in this area? <laughs> lobster, no! No, Mr. Krabs! Well, Mr. Krabs is a crab, not a lobster, so that doesn't make any sense. Can I think of a lobster? <laughs> Alt my lover, no! Or lobster? Is it lobster or lover? I don't know. It's from Starfy. The legendary Starfy. Amazing game. Or at least, well, it's a fun game. I wouldn't say it's an amazing game, but it's a fun Laid back, chilly really game. The older games are all in Japanese, so yeah, that kind of sucks. Because they're actually, well, no, I think they're good. The thing is, you can't really call it that good because it's Starfy and there's not really much to it when it comes to difficulty or whatever. But it's still fun. <laughs> and that's the most important part. I'm gonna go back for a second. Because... <clears throat> I want to see what's in that cave. Yes, that cave. I'm going up here and going to the right. There was this area, which is able to... Is it? Hmm. I don't know, there's just a hole. A hole in the wall. A hole. Uh, ah, I got you. So, I disabled them for now. What is that? What is that gonna do for me? There you go. Ah, uh, this is a thingy magic that I cannot do anything with. Die, sea urchins, die! You are greener than me! It's a sin. It's a bloody sin! I like saying bloody with like the English. Uh, the English. Uh, with the. Oh, oh! What, what happened? Oh, okay. It was uh, with the, uh, the English accent. Or British accent, I'm sorry. English, <laughs> English is a language, not a not a people. <laughs> not a people. Well, does it, wait, does it make sense? I don't know, man. I don't even know what makes sense anymore. I'm just talking shit over here. Now we're here. Okay, let's go and get some more. Bless. Give me your treasure. Another magic bottle. Wow. Two magic bottles in one area. I get blizzard. Summons a blizzard attack. Okay. Like the music. Well, it, uh, once again. I think I'm gonna say it like a million times. By the way. Like the. I like the music. 
Oh, did, did I forget today that I like the music in this game? Yeah, I like the music. I'm also thinking about maybe playing this game with, uh, with Cube on the co-op part of the channel. This might be a fun game to co-op. Even though it is not particularly an easy game, but that does, it doesn't always have to be an easy game. We've played Dark Souls, we've played... Um, have we played any other game that's really difficult? <laughs> Man, I gotta think for a second. The thing is, we've played so many games, I don't even know. Nah, crap. <laughs> nah, crap. Mm. Hey, life bottle, nice. That is really nice. Okay, now we have to murder these crabs again. Crablicious! Come on, move. Move! I will probably show off the... Uh, the blizzard attack eventually. I don't know when. Oh, then. Oh, I missed. I finally got it right. I finally got the dough I missed right, which is really satisfying to be able to finally do it without sounding absolutely horrifying. Whoops, let's just go into this because I don't feel like de-equipping my shovel and equipping it again literal seconds later. Ah, screw you. <laughs> I do like the way that the that, uh, Master Higgins looks when he walks around with the shovel. He's like, I'm gonna shovel ya, bruh. <laughs> Say goodbye to your kneecaps. Oh. Hmm. Thing is, I don't have the aqua. The aqua. I don't have the awkward sword, and I'm awkward. <laughs> I don't have the awkward sword. I am awkward, but I don't have the sword. <laughs> I don't have the awkward sword, so I'm not gonna. I'm not going to challenge the boss quite yet. I could though. I definitely could. I also don't think it would be too difficult, but still. Better save than sorry. Ow. <laughs> I'm better safe than sorry. Ow. Okay, continue digging. The most annoying mechanic in this game, definitely. The ding is kind of stupid. It's stupid! Uh, switch to the ice sword again. <laughs> Do I missed? Ah, oh, that one is really dang bad. Die, starfish, die! The only starfish I love is Patrick! Point. There we go. Ah, oh. oh. oh, dang. Okay, let's go up here. All the way back to end up over here. Now, end up, end up over here. Oh. Nice. Die, ah. Die, you cretin! Now I'm kind of hoping, ho hoping, kind of hoping that there is something useful over here. Though. Ah, ah, oh, come, can't believe you done this. Also, not saying that. That's because I'm a meme lord. Well, maybe not a meme lord, but I'm. I know a bunch of memes, <laughs> which is not good. Come on, open up. What do I get? The Thunderstone. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I got a Thunderstone. Now I can finally evolve my Pikachu into Raichu. Works well in water. Well, yeah. Well, it's probably gonna hurt you also. You, the user. Ow. God damn it. Now we have another, like, quote unquote neutral sword, I think. Like, it wouldn't do less damage against other enemies. I'm, ver I'm very unsure about what I'm saying, by the way. <laughs> Could be that I'm right. Could be that I'm wrong. That's the magic of watching another dude play a game or say something. You never know if they are right. And always assume that they are wrong. <laughs> because otherwise you might end up in a bad spot. There we go. I'm also thinking about doing Yoshi's Island. Uh, ooh, Yoshi's Island. Well, that's gonna be into. Whoa, that was nice. That's gonna be interesting because... Well, it's never gonna be a one. A one. A one. A hundred percent is never gonna be that. Never in my life. I've tried it a couple of times and it ruins the game. Trying to go for all of the stuff is something else. Trying to go for all of the stuff is interesting, but trying to... Trying to 100% the game is just too much. 
it really isn't. Either I am really bad at the game, or it's just really difficult, but I have a... I've never been able to do it in my life. And every single time I tried to do it, I stopped halfway through, through the game because I was just like, Nope. I don't want to do this. Screw this. <laughs> basically, yeah, basically Mario vs. Donkey. The end of Mario vs. Donkey, basically. <laughs> nice. Last minute down... Downstrap safe. Downstrap? Downstrap safe. Um, I am going to... Is this the right way? Yeah. I am going to go and fight and defeat the boss. This episode, which is going to be in the episode, is going to be a little bit longer. But I don't really think that anybody minds that too much. Ah, oh, damn. It's very difficult to get a combo going with that uh, the downward thrust. It is fun to do, though. Okay. Uh, now we have to go and start shoveling our way to the boss. I'll meet you there, because... Reasons. Have you noticed, like, Higgins' abs when he's when he takes... Uh, MEGA ABS! SUPER BEEF! If anybody knows that reference, then you know what a good game is. With a reference, I mean super beef. Maximum beef. And all that stress. Just... It's amazing. Okay, the boss! Nice! Oh no! Tentacles! Oh no! My worst nightmare! Okay. Back off! By the way, you don't have to stab these things. <laughs> I just like stabbing these things because I'm weird. Because I'm weird. I'm weird. And here is the big boy himself. So, you want to hit this tentacle, then his head goes up. And then you can attack him. Ah! Okay, and now everything... Normally it gets really dark, I think. But, um... Or, I'm really not sure what's supposed to happen, but I'm playing it on an emulator, so... If there are a little graphical glitches, then this might be one of them. My apologies. Point. Wah. I like that. I like the sound when you hit bosses. Nice. Oh no! The more he uses it, the darker it gets. Okay. I got you now. Uh, by the way, you cannot use magic when you're in this boss because you, you're constantly swimming, which means that you cannot use magic. And it really sucks if you want to heal, so... Hey. <laughs> if you put all your stats into magic, you're screwed now. <laughs> yeah. Thank god there isn't a stat system in this game, and I have to think about it also. That's the lovely thing about... About playing some of these simpler games. Oh, oh shite. I might be running into some issues. Okay, yep, now it, now it gets really dark. And also a little bit slow downy. <laughs> a little bit laggy. I'm really not sure if this is supposed to make a difference or not. It could be. It could be that it's supposed to make a difference, but it doesn't really make a bunch of dif uh, a bunch. <laughs> a bunch of difference. It doesn't make a lot of difference for me, so... Come on. Tentacle. Get that tentacle out of here! Ah, yes! Haha! <laughs> we got him in the final hit, that was nice. Yay, we won! And we get the Moonstone! Higgins, here's a voice! Again. Ah, uh, I seem to remember. I was traveling with a brave but somewhat chubby fellow named, uh... You know, I used to be a great... You know, I used to be a great traveler myself. Sometimes I get glimpses of when I sail the seas with love in my heart. And... But that's all I can remember. You know, we may have met at some other time in some distant land. I know I've heard your voice before. 
and your face, it's so warm and kind. I think I could have loved you. I'm really not sure who, which of the characters said the last part, but I don't care. Uh, you know, I'm gonna wait for a drink, I'm gonna end up the episode first, and then I'm gonna start drinking like crazy. Okay. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this episode. It was an interesting one. Going to the Aqua World. Aqua World. Aqua World. And then, uh... Yeah. Next episode. What are we gonna do next episode? Yeah. It's always difficult having to end up when you don't have, like, a definitive thing that you're gonna say. Um... Huh. Is it always highlighting the area that you have to go? Because, uh, I didn't know about this. Oh well, I guess we'll see. I hope you enjoyed this episode nonetheless, and I'll see you guys next episode. Goodbye!